I learned a lot on this film. Uh, how to do a three-two time. Yeah, moonwalking. Moonwalking. And tap dance. Um, I knew how to moonwalk. Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> but your step shuffle turn is yeah without parallel. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Because no one else can do that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I think, yeah, same sort of rhythm. <laughs> Over to you. Uh, my name is Ed McGrath and I play Nicholas in The Sun. The Sun. <laughs> so I'm laughing because it's so rare for me to <laughs> be with someone we're speaking with our Aussie, Australian, Aussie yeah. accents. Yeah. Uh, I'm Hugh Jackman and I play Peter Miller, the father of the son. It's been really a dream production, honestly. Like everyone's been so kind and though like I feel like during a takes you have to go to a really dark place in between takes, it's really easy to sort of, you know, crack a joke or relax a bit. Um, yeah, this happened I think I wasn't really sure what to expect because it's the First time I've worked during COVID and I knew there were a lot of protocols and masks and these people can't talk to you and that. Mm, and yeah. I think I think it's an Aussie thing. I, I feel very comfortable when everyone's in together. There's no delineation of this person can't speak to this one or yeah, that. Yeah, it's a bit weird. But actually yeah. it didn't feel like that at all. Particularly once you get onto set, um, it, it's a relatively small crew from what I'm used to and very close and open and um supportive and there have been some really tough days i've been really super proud of my son <laughs> but i really i really have been uh sorry zen's dad's over there feels a bit weird me saying i'm proud of him but i am i'm I really know. you know it's uh it's been one of the most challenging movies i've shot because not just the subject matter but because florian writes scenes so well that have two things going on at once um, which is just challenging and the kind of challenge you want as an actor. So it's been really a supportive set, I would say, yeah. fun set. It's almost like a small town, like a family, like yeah. in a way, like everyone knows everyone. Yeah, don't well, look me in the eye. I've told you not to look okay, me in the I'm eye like sorry. that. That's just, weird. Yeah. I hear. Just talk about me, but not looking at me. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. He's beginning. You'll get it. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm, you, I'm sorry, I'm new with yeah, this. You'll understand. <laughs> You know, we play father, son, and I am a son and I'm a father. So, uh, and you're a son. So, yeah. and we, I think both intrinsically understand that every loving relationship in a family goes through a lot of, whew, this just happens to have a lot more probably ups and downs. Yeah. But I think you can't really act some of the stuff we've been acting if there's not a feeling of trust. And that's not just between us uh, with all the actors and particularly with the director with Florian and he really we had a lot of conversations before really discussing it and making sure we were comfortable and with each other and yeah and you making know. sure we sort of got to know each other a bit first before we dive into this cause, yeah because yeah, you have to know each other a bit yeah to form that connection so then you can sever it you know <laughs> yeah right but it yeah. uh you know and I think we checked in with each other along the way yeah <clears throat> ground zero yeah, he, he knew nothing. He knew how to walk and that was about it, yeah. Mm. <laughs> they don't have the term here, daggy dad dancing. You don't... No, I've heard what, that. What, what is the oh, English yeah. version of dag? Do you know what a dag is? I mean, I, I know what daggy is, but you would just say dad dancing. Oh, you're saying oh. you don't have to say daggy dad dancing? <laughs> well, in Australia, yeah. some dads clearly are called a couple. Mm. So you have to qualify. Daggy means goofy. So I did, I did my best. Yeah. But, uh, it was actually really fun doing this dance scene because... <laughs> It was so bad. Like my dancer, oh man, no flow whatsoever. Just. Do you know how I practiced all that? Ow. With Ava, my 16 year old. And I was like, listen, I don't know what, here's the scene. And I showed her the first one. She goes, mm mm. <laughs> I showed her another one. She goes, mm. And I showed her the third one. She just burst out laughing. She goes, that's it. That's yeah. perfect. So I did have to, Yeah. I did have to get the approval from my very cool 16 year old. <laughs> And we, we had a whole, you know, a whole plan to break out into a tap dance routine, like yeah. in that scene, and like you know, have the walls fall apart and it's a musical all of a sudden. Yeah. But uh, we never, never got around to doing we that. We pitched it to Florian. Yeah, he didn't. No. Didn't quite land, I don't think. I don't know why. 
Yeah, so, uh, it's an intimidating thing. I know. Uh, you know, yeah. all of a sudden turning your film into a musical. Some people can handle it, others can't. Yeah, obviously. You know, yeah. Right. The sequel. I think there's a musical sequel. Here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or an action movie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nicholas is suffering from acute depression. You give these big speeches about life, and then you abandon us. I have the right to reinvent my life! 完璧な親はいない。そして完璧な子供も。That's my little boy. I can't give up on him.